Given points A, B, and C, use a compass and straight edge to construct point D so that A, B, C, D is a parallelogram. So again, the app that I'm using does not have a virtual compass and straight edge. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to narrate um, how you're supposed to operate your compass as well as draw in the various uh, compass and straight edge markings that you should have. Okay. So um, what we're trying to do here is we're trying to uh, construct D so that ABCD is a parallelogram. So also be aware, what I'm about to do, this is not um, the only way. That, in fact, there are three different answers to this question, um, depending upon how you want to uh, locate D. But looking at this, it looks like they want us to um, position point D uh, if we were to draw this in a uh, to continue in the clockwise counterclockwise orientation that they have for us because if you look at this right now ABC is drawn in a counterclockwise rotation right so that means D would have to be located over here somewhere right so we're going to use methods of construction to figure it out Alright, so how are we going to do that? Uh, so, we want D to be over here. That means we want the angle that's over here to be copied over to the other side. So how are we going to do that? What I'm going to do is I'm going to connect these three points together and I want to identify where that point is on the other side. What I do know is, on the um, on a parallelogram, opposite sides are supposed to be congruent. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to place my pen on C, open it up so that the lead is on B. I want to make a mark there to indicate that I am measuring the length of CB. I am then going to pick up my compass place my comp my pin on A and I am going to make a mark like so. So all the points on that arc to point A, that is a distance of CB. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to measure the length of um, I'm going to measure the length of AB. So I'm going to place my pin on A, and I am going to uh, put my lead on B once again, and I want to make a mark like so. So right now, the compass is opened up to the, to the length of AB. I pick up my compass, place my pin on C, and do not change the compass setting. You're going to make a mark. You're going to make an arc so that the arc that you're going to draw now will intersect with the arc that you made a moment ago. The intersection of those two arcs will give you D prime. So if I connect and connect, I will have a parallelogram 